In this video, we're going to cover resizing your default lightbox size for your Super Skeleton theme. We will be using a YouTube video lightbox as our example, but this video will offer some insight into how to do this for other medias such as images, flash, and more. Let's start by opening one of our lightboxes on our portfolio page. As you can see, this lightbox is linked to a YouTube video with a predetermined size. For those who are viewing your site on a larger monitor, this may look smaller than you would like it. And although your viewer has the full screen option, there should be a happy default medium in between the two sizes. To alter the lightbox, we will need to go into the post that that video is linked to. So make a note of the post title. Let's go back, open our WordPress dashboard, and navigate to our posts. Let's open Portfolio Post 11 and zone in on the custom lightbox link under the Super Skeleton Post options. Here we will find the link that the lightbox is opening. All we need to do is add a bit of text at the end of it. Just add width equals 800 and height equals 600 at the end of the URL. This will make the default lightbox viewing area for this link 800 pixels by 600 pixels when it is available. Click Update. Navigate back to your portfolio page. Click Refresh. And now when you launch the lightbox for that link, it will open to 800 by 600. Note that with a responsive theme such as this one, larger lightboxes will be scaled down if they are larger than the viewing area of the site. Notice that on a larger screen such as this one, the lightbox default view is expanded. But if we were to scale down the site, the lightbox will scale itself accordingly. As you might have noticed, this will not change your lightboxes across your site. You will have to adjust each of these individually unless you are confident in your abilities to alter the code in the core theme files. If you have any questions, want more information, or the full documentation on the lightboxes used for the Super Skeleton themes, check out No Margin for Errors to see the full documentation on the Pretty Photo lightbox that we are using. You can also search Pretty Photo and find the No Margin for Errors site here. You can also find us on the Theme Forest Forum, check out our other videos on our YouTube channel, and keep up to date with us at mdnw.net. I'm Charlie, thanks for watching.